the 16th day of Vlogmas, 16th of December 2022. The pitter pattering is Jenny's little feet down on the floor. I am in the kitchen because my husband's still in bed. So, um, sitting in the kitchen eating my porridge. I've just answered and uh, replied to all the comments for the last two days. So, thank you very much for sticking with me. Um, I'm feeling fine today. Um, I don't know how long it was, but it was, but when I went to the doctor, she gave me some special tablets to take when I get a migraine, when they first come on. Hang on. Jenny, do you mind? Um, and so I had one of those yesterday morning and um, it just speeds up the recovery. I mean, just the fact that I was able to go in the shop in the afternoon and that I feel fine today. So that is good. Um, a couple of jokes, see if I can find them. I'd said to leave jokes, so a few of you did. Uh, how can I get to them? Comments. Um, do, 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 do. Gail, what is a lamb's favourite Christmas carol? Have yourself a merry little Christmas. <laughs> um, who else left a joke? Let's see. Oh, I might be able to find it. Paul put, I met a Dutch girl with inflatable shoes last week, phoned her up to arrange a date, but unfortunately she'd popped her clocks. <laughs> that made me giggle. And Jilly said, what's the best Christmas present? A broken drum. You just can't beat it. <laughs> I think that one came up in my Christmas jokes on Vlogmas last year, didn't it? But it is a good one. Okay, so it is 10 to 8 and I need to get myself ready. Um, and I need to do two days worth of Advent as well, don't I? To catch up for yesterday. And I need to find out what Jenny wants. She's snuffling at the bottom of the door now. My husband's got up. Jenny's, well, she would be happy, but she's gone in the bathroom. So now she's feeling all forlorn again. Right. Um, who watched the darts last night? Started last night? I watched the first couple of hours. Or... I think I went to bed about nine just to try and catch up and um, <clears throat> my husband and my daughter stayed up and watched all of it so I'm looking forward to it, I love the darts. Uh, it's the only sport really that I watch, yes. darts. Shall we do advent calendars? What's the date? Oh dear, what day is it? Maybe our brain's not quite working. Hang on, okay so it's the 16th today. <laughs> So we want 15 and 16. Ooh, 15 I found. A big long one. Any writing? <clears throat> the ultimate smoky eye essential. Let's see. It's an eyeliner. <clears throat> Limitless. Limitless long wear pencil eyeliner. In black, I'm assuming. Oh, that's a nice charcoaly black, isn't it? I do try to avoid black, but I'd love to work out how to do smoky eye things. Just, I've never been great at makeup. Uh, <clears throat> got a bit of a frog this morning. 16, there we are. 16. No writing on that one. Let's see, it's a tube. It's a tube. You ready already? In transit, camera close up. Be ready for close up in seconds with mask, moisturizer, and primer in one. Oh, cool. I don't have a primer at the moment, so that's good. Excellent. Put this one back and then let's have a look in the other one. Gel, dramatically different, hydrating gel, anti-pollution. The only thing is with these, when they go all these different, so you have like face creams and serums and anti-polluting gel, and do you wear them all or do you just choose which one on certain days or 
Do you layer them up like a, I don't know, what do you layer, a cake? I don't know, that's, that's my only thought. Do you know what, oops, knocked it over. Uh, this morning I got out of the shower and I thought, oh, I'll use this little tube of moisturiser, put it all over my face, then put my glasses on and read it and it was eye cream. So my whole face has been eye creamed. <clears throat> 16. It's a little box. Can we on? Where's the. Can you read that? Is that? I don't know if that's focusing. I can't see. Moisture surge intense. You see, that's another moisturiser, which is great, but do I do that and that? And the other one that I've got? And the. the, the what's the sequence? Do we need all that many things? Or what I tend to do is I do wash cleanse and then moisturize and I have used a uh, no, what they're called serum I've got like a vitamin C one from A1 which I liked but I've not been using it lately just because my skin's felt so dry that I've just felt like I've been having to put like really rich moisturizers in <sighs> that was an interesting story wasn't it right I'm going to get dressed and Get ready for work. Everywhere's looking so frosty. White. Ooh, winter, winter. It's supposed to get milder at the weekend, so fingers crossed. I mean, it does look beautiful, to be fair. It's just been nice to be warm, winter. I've not been busy, I've had a couple of sales, so that's good. But I've been doing loads of social media posts because yesterday I didn't really do any. And I don't think I did many the day before either. So I thought I'll blast out some social media posts. Put the kettle on, let's get the kettle on. And um, I've had a delivery of art stuff. Ooh, but I leave that for my husband to do. But he's, he's out, he's got to appointments this morning. So he'll do that this afternoon. Um, I've got some music on in the background, but it's just a kind of... I don't know what they call it. It's like background, it's like lift music to be honest, with a bit of a Christmassy tilt. <laughs> but it's fine when I'm concentrating, I don't really want music on. Looking a bit gappy, I've sold some teapots. In fact, it's looking a bit gappy everywhere. I need to hit the sales and get some stuff. I need to hit the auctions or, it's not really car boot season, is it? So, looking good over here with my tins though bad down here just with my general stock it's looking a bit thin on the ground it's not if you looked around you'd go oh there's a lot of stuff but to me there's gaps I did buy some <laughs> stock off a customer yesterday so I've got that to show you if I can between customers this was one of the things that came in <laughs> Garfield I love Garfield I had a busy spell it's about quarter to 12 now yeah I had a really busy spell which is great um, I've just had a parcel delivered and I've opened it up and I don't remember ordering anything. And I've got a little jingly jangly parcel. Look. Do you watch Ashley on Paper on Twine? We'll go do it. She's a very talented lady. I'm going to open the card, but I'm going to save the Prezi. Let's have a look. Oh, wow. Look at that. Oh, I love how these stars really shine. From our home to yours. Are oh, those just so gorgeous? They're like pearlescent. She's so clever. Dear Kirsten, the enclosed isn't a Christmas present, but a little something to brighten your day in the shop. I think I showed how to make it in day four of Vlogmas. This will probably reach you after Christmas, but I hope you have a restful time with your family. Best wishes, Ashley. 
paper into mine. Oh, does that mean I can open it now? Isn't that lovely? Well, she's given me permission then. I'm sure she said isn't. I did read that correctly, didn't I? Let me just double check. Isn't. Right. Okay. Oh, and bells. They're gorgeous little copper bells. I did watch her um, making these the other day. I don't want to break it. I can, oh, I can just slide out what it is without breaking the whole thing. Hang on a minute. A little bit of fiddly fiddly. Oh, my fingers aren't quite long enough. Right, I can manage to get it out without breaking it. Isn't that gorgeous? I'm just going to put that out as a little decoration. I absolutely love Lindor. Don't tell any of my family that I got that. <laughs> and um <clears throat> my daughter made me some jam and toast and a cup of tea so i've just had that and it seems to have quietened off a bit so i'm going to try and show you some of this stock that came in yesterday floor because somebody's bound to come in mid me showing you so i'll turn the camera around and show you so i got three jugs this lovely blue one a lovely tall blue one and then this one this engraved one I got a couple of plates. There's this one, it's an unusual design, and then it says Kerry Blue New Zealand on the back. This sort of Japanese plate, it's rather nice. Um, I don't really know what these dishes are used for particularly, but you could put your nibbles in there, can you? There's some more, I'm guess guessing that that maybe would have had one of those metal things on top at one point but anywho, I've got one of those then I've got I think there's six of these so I need to get those priced and out I've got a little Royal Crown Derby butter dish and knife and some other little bits of glass going on tankard and then there's also some like tumblers and then there's this sort of bird cage candlestick thing we also got this sign and a couple of bowls they unwrapped that one isn't that lovely like studio pottery i think there is a maker's mark there not very distinctive but they're gorgeous, aren't they? So two of those. Uh, is that everything? Oh, and then this fish thing. I thought it was going to be just one of these sort of things that you pick up from homey kind of shops. But it's actually signed underneath. Oops. There we go. Mike Lithgow, 1993, two fish. Got a little bit of paint on them though. Look. Yeah. A little bit different. It's been great today. Uh, it's gone quiet now. Um, I'm having problems with my phone and my iPad though because they both just keep switching off. I think it's the cold. <laughs> it's ridiculous. Yeah, they keep just shutting down completely. So then I have to plug them in again to charge to wake them up again. So apologies if you get no more vlog today. <laughs> I also got this lamp with that jablut. It's kind of cool. Habitat Bobby Lamp also want to say thank you to Margot for ordering on my website. I'm going to pack that up. I don't know if I'll get a chance to take it to the post office today. I'll take it tomorrow morning. Um, I've got to go and deliver those the things that I sold at somebody's house after work. It's about four o'clock. I've been helping my husband price up some stuff to go out. I've had a few customers. It's been good. It's starting to get dark now and even colder. Anyway, I will stop moaning about the cold at some point in my life. Uh, in the meantime, thank you very much for watching. Hope you've enjoyed. Give us a little thumbs up emojis in the comments. Uh, subscribe. Seriously, subscribe if you haven't already. Um, take care, stay safe, and I'll see you tomorrow.